These are all staples up to her staples. And the first common one is right here, the broccoli. We've gotten all of the Shopkins except for the ones in limited exclusive. We've got in three of those. And so this is the last common Shopkin. And all these are rares up to the yogurt guy. And and the last one of those is a uh, Wanda Waffler. And. Hold on. So up to here is rare. Yeah, and rare. And then, then what comes next? Um, special edition. Yeah, special edition. Okay. And then the last ones down here are ultra rare. It's just those three aren't. Uh, and we on the waffles is the last, last ultra rare. Do not waste your gems on clicking on these things because they're wasteful. And do not uh, waste your gems on getting up these things because you can already get gems by playing games. And if you don't have all of these staple and rare jars, then do not click on these power-ups. You can click on them and then uh, if it's wasteful, you can click on them again and that won't waste your coins. Mm -hmm. So we got that thing that cost a hundred gems. And we can like play with three players and it like is like massive of loving leveling up and you can click on this thing that gives you more time five seconds more so go, go, go back a second i want to explain to them some something else so we want to give you a little strategy because we we built this up and we didn't pay any dollars any money to buy the gems but we've gotten almost all of them and what you need to understand is the further down the list you are, like if you're clear up here at the beginning, these players are not very powerful. Yeah, because we have barely ever played with these guys. The first one we played with was this carrot guy right there. Yeah. So you want to use your players that are further down, as far down the list as you can get. So we got to a point where we had a few of them down here and we use carrot carrot cake almost all the time you can see that her level is 1940 level yeah and the, this so, one just hold on so her points per pop is 3969 points per pop and that one is a second one but i meant third because we have another yeah, one so this that's... one hold on this one gets 2193 per pop and you have to pay attention to their abilities like carrot carrot cake if you click on it it will make a bunch of the shopkins disappear and give you one chef hat bubble if yeah, you click on cupcake pop. princess it will it will give you four chef hat four bubbles. chef hat bubbles and th the other one that we play with is is sweet honey sweet. she gives us the uh, uh, same amount as cupcake princess but she's the second one that we've always played right. with and she's the third one so this one gets three thousand and that one's the fourth yeah hold on this one gets three thousand five hundred fifty points per pop and it's on level one thousand seven hundred thirty We've built all these up simply by playing the game in a strategic way to move through it rather quickly. So you want to try to scan your Shopkins if you can find them. There's lots of YouTube videos uh, where you can scan other people, put their codes on there. It will help. Or if you have your own Shopkins, we have a few of our own Shopkins. I have Ten of them. I've lost Toasty Warm. Mm. She's rare. Do you want to show? You want to show them what you have? Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. So. 
Uh, her eyes disappeared on this one. This one is caramel topping. Can you can you turn on the lights so they can see? Okay. Turn on the lights. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So these are. What's this one? This one's caramel topping. Caramel topping. This one is Madeline Muffin right here. Here's Madeline Muffin. At the bottom is the scanning thing. Mm -hmm. So you can scan it from there. Okay. And here is the corn guy. Here's the corn guy. We're giving you enough time to scan these guys so you don't have to plot it in the middle of the video. Mm -hmm. There you go. This, this is Sam Soy that I lost for a tiny bit. Sam Soy. Okay. My favorite one is this one without eyes, even though they're not there, they used to be there. What's this one? This one's Nina Noodles. Nina Noodles. And she has a Natalie that's her, called Natalie Noodles, mm -hmm. and she's in the recipe. What's this one? Uh, Roma t tomato. Oh, I'm gonna do the back of this one. It's on the back, not the bottom. This one is my second favorite right here that I'm holding now, but it's not Roma tomato. Just gonna make sure I get a good scan on that one. Okay. Yeah, this one is my second favorite. That's Leah Flower. She's my second favorite. And my third favorite is Jasmine Rice. Okay, hold on. Because my friend has it. In the start, I thought it was like sauerkraut or something. I didn't know what, okay, what it was. Okay, there's that one. And what else do we have? <laughs> that wasn't a shop game. This one's Jasmine Rice. Okay. I only Jasmine have three Rice. rare ones and not any other ones. I okay. only have three rare ones, a couple stamples, and all the rest are commons. Sam Soy is uh, common. So you want to scan them because what happens is when you scan them in the game, Stay it will it will give you an increased level to begin with. So it will give you kind of an advanced jump start on it. <clears throat> but you want to be careful about like like she said you, you want to be careful about spending all your gems just to advance the game because the gems and your coins are the key to getting more players so we have right now we have three thousand nine hundred three million nine hundred forty one thousand two hundred twenty coins because we don't have a need for coins anymore because when you go to buy new players for the game Those the staple jar gets is a thousand all a thousand coins and then the rare jar which includes ultra rare special edition rare and common are three thousand so what we found though is after a while when you get near the top it for some reason they'll you'll buy them and they'll you'll end up buying ones you already have and they credit you back the coins but it's not the same coins that you spend so you have to work really hard to get all of these and you can barely get any coins if you play with those shopkins we just told you that have give us less points so we have almost all of these we just need some of the limited edition and shop exclusive that's all we need we need 13 more of those in order to get all the players but we found that you can probably spend the 30 gems even though we have all the ultra rares and special editions you can probably we can probably spend the 30 gems and they won't give us the same ones that we already have we hope because we were saving up 70 gems you know thinking that we had to get 70 to get one of these two so we didn't double everything but <clears throat> when you get back here you really want to pay attention to this thing right here because this Skip is what gets you gems. this is what gets you more gems is following these tasks 
So they want you to use five different helper Shopkins. The daily special you can only complete one time, but when you when you play it, when you go to play, Wait, and you've you, got no the jars, you yeah. can click on these power ups. So when you when you get enough enough level on each of these players that you're playing with. It's beneficial to use all these, we found out, because you end up getting more coins than you spend here. So each one of these costs a different 1,000 coins, 1,500 coins, 1,800 coins, 500, 500, 500. So each one of those is going to cost coins, but if your players are, are high enough, then it won't matter because you're, you're going to get more coins than what you spend. So... Like she said, you want to unlock this third one as soon as you can, even though it costs 100 gems, because it'll compound the amount of... It will, like, give you, like, it will, like, level up, like, crazy amounts. That thing makes you level up, and we get, like, crazy amounts of scores because yeah. of that, too. So let's, sh let's show them. Let's play one game here for them. And what's our goal again? Our goal is to click on them five, five times. Five different helper Shopkins. So we have three. So if we play all three of these, then it will be three of the five. So we have to click on them, Dad? Yeah, we'll have to, we'll have to play them. Yeah. So we'll go ahead and play. This is how you play. You can just put your finger on the screen and make some chains. Don't just press stir the whole time. It wastes your time, but if you don't have any chains, you can press stir. So you can see these special abilities. A lot of the special abilities are the same. Like they either give you chef hat bubbles or it pops a bunch of them for you and gives you a chef hat bubble. If you do the rice one, the rice one gives you, what, five extra seconds? Yeah, five extra seconds. And some, we barely ever do that one, but they still give us a bunch of points. This one gives us like a crazy amount of points. And we got Bubble Cupcake that does the same thing, but she pops 19 Shopkins. That's so I should be playing many. with her. I don't know why we're not playing with her. We'll show you after this game. You want to play with her? Yeah. We'll show you after this game with the Freddy Fred Rice and the other ones. Freddy Fred Rice, okay. And the Bubble Cupcake. And we'll show you what Bessie Bull does too. Never click the gym thing at the end right here. Yeah. Never you, click don't, that. Don't do that because if you click on that, it, you'll lose gems and it's really not worth it. Unless, it, unless you're... See, they level, they max out every time we do this. And look at, at our crazy amount of score. But we still get, like, that thing right there, five, and we barely can ever beat it unless we spend that three gems that we told you at the end. Today. You're saying our highest score is, like, five yeah. million? Okay, so now you want to max them out, too, because when they get to a max level... You want to be able to let them max for the next game. It'll cost, what does it say, 1,200 coins? Yeah, it'll cost this many coins right down there. And it says if they level up five times right there, right. they will max out. Right, go to the sweets one. You gotta do the sweets one too. I already maxed her. Are you already sweet? I need to max the carrot cake. No. Oh, the carrot cake one. Okay. So we're going to change these guys out, and so... Just to let them see it or something? Yeah. So uh, I, I said last time we were going to show you what Bubble Cupcake, Bessie Bowl would do, and what was the last one? Oh, the yeah. The rice one. The rice. I'm going to show you guys what that guy does. So... I accidentally so if you want to know what any of the abilities of any of them that we have do just put it in the comments and we could comment back to you what their special ability is some of them create a rainbow some of them just create some special effect across the screen Bessie Bull is one of my favorite because yeah. she does like the, a crazy amount of cha a long chain yeah. you'll, we'll, 
we'll click on it and show you how long she makes a chain. Never press stir if there's like, uh, if there's no chain, you can press stir, but just don't press stir at a random time where there's a bunch of chains. So this will add five seconds to the chain, time. Which helps a little bit, but not enough to where we feel like to use it all the time. If it only was 10, that would be way yeah. much better. But like 20 would be way better. Okay, so okay. this is the bubble cupcake bubble I was cupcake. talking about. She, w I told you she would pop 19 Shopkins. Is that how many she did? Yeah, I counted the thing. It said 19 mm -hmm. right there. Actually, I didn't count it. It just said 19 right there. This is See, Bessie Bowl. Look how long chains th it does. What was our goal again, Dad? Um, not we had to use some oh, yeah, shotguns. Yeah. Oh, you added five seconds, huh? Yeah. Which, I just one. like stirring it at the end, but nobody maxed out. I don't nobody know why. Out. Oh, it's because they had not very much points yeah. that they gave us. So they're not as big a levels as the other ones that we play with. We so we did meet that. our we met our goal though, right? Oh, now we have to play with those other two guys. I'll just put her in the middle. Mm. Which one, Kara Kiraki? I'll just put Bessie Bowen in the middle. Let's put carrot carrot cake. Let's get um, the carrot cake is in the bakery. You can just go down three times and then she's there. You can change out like your shop. Let's change three. out the race one. Yeah, I, I know. Like I know. I know. They give us less points there. Okay. Now we have to click on festival once and make a chain of ten or more Shopkins so we can make a whole chain of festival. Okay. Let's do that. And my third favorite or fourth was best I meant was a brand banana smoothie, which is that one. I've actually made the real recipe with my mom. Of what? The real recipe of brand banana smoothie oh, you guys with my make, mom. You guys made banana I didn't smoothies? really like it because it had peanut butter in it. And it didn't taste very good because of the peanut butter. I think mm. it would taste better without the peanut butter. The other thing you can do is, on some of them, if you start the chain and then press your helper shopkin, you can finish the chain. Well, watch, start a chain. Uh, not like that. Okay. You can actually finish the chain while while it's still popping. Oh, I know what what, what you mean. Saying. Yeah, yeah. You can start a chain. Okay. See, it'll let you finish the chain. And it saves you time because it actually pauses the clock while it's popping those other things. Did we do a thing of 10? Yeah, okay. we did 13, so that would be better. It said you can make more Shopkin, so you can do that. I think we've actually um, explained everything about it. Yeah, pretty pretty much. We almost took that gem thing. Oh, you can you can pause it right here, not at the end, yeah. but like in the middle of the game if you have to go pee or something. Yeah, but you don't want to. What what does it say? Like restart the game because then you lose your yeah. heart. Yeah, uh, actually you don't. But if you press exit, you actually lose it. If you play retry, you just lose all the points mm. that you got, and you lose the coins that you would get. Right that you would get. So we have to max these out. And you just keep at that process till you've acquired enough gems to go back and buy the other shoppy exclusive or limited edition ones that we're trying to get. Yeah, we're trying to get 30 gems or 70. We're actually trying to get 70, actually, because 70 actually gives us like more Shopkins, uh, we're like taking a really big risk hitting that thing, and that thing we're not making a very big risk. Yeah, the risk is if we hit this 30, 
they might give us a ultra rare or a special edition which we already have all of those but there is a you know a chance that we could get a Shopee, Shopee. exclusive yeah. and when we got that thing we were like really good oh I forgot that the, we were playing with this people so I didn't know which one we were playing with so we got these two right here. Cupcake Petal, we got, uh, the first one we got was Bessie Bowl. The second one we got was Cupcake Petal. Yesterday, we got Bubble Cupcake. Mm. And we got Bubble Cupcake from, guess which jar we got it from? We got it from the 30 gem jar. Yeah. We were taking a huge risk. But we got it. And they didn't give us one we already had. So that was good because then we didn't have to spend 70 gems. We only had to spend 30. It will still give us some gems back. I've actually never noticed that until now. Because mm -hmm. last time when we clicked this, mm -hmm. it gives us coins back. What We already got those Shopkins. It just wastes our coins if we just like uh, get one of those shards again that we've already gotten a bunch of them yet and we're going to show you tomorrow how to get uh, gems or maybe today yeah, maybe we'll make another video about that but today. leave your comments below and please subscribe thank you thank you